You're probably wondering why is the phone case on top of the box. I'm glad you've asked. Personal information, and this is another iPhone case from AT&T. This is the one that replaced that iPhone case that I got from them that they claim that worked with the 13 Pro Max, but it, originally, but it really works with the um, 12 Pro Max. So I gave that case to my sister because she has the 12 Pro Max. So I wouldn't have to discard it. So this is the replacement for that. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. Here we go. So I'm gonna do that off camera because I don't want nobody to get my information. I'll be right back. All right, let's see what we got. Let's get it open. I'll turn it this way so y'all won't see my information. I do apologize. I can't do a good job of hiding it, but right, here we go again. <laughs> so I'm gonna get it, huh? Let's hope that's not the case. Let's hope we people won't do that. Otherwise, you'll get in trouble. Right, we go. I'm a bit of a freak show here because it's just an iPhone case. There's nothing heavy in the box to hold it. Gosh. All this just to get a case out of here. Whatever. All right, so this is what it looks like right here. It's a very standard case, specifically designed for a 13 Pro Max, not the 12 Pro Max, but the 13 Pro Max. Pure Guard is the brand name of it. It doesn't have that real closeness where you can see it up real close. Not the camera app I'm using. My apologies to you. So we're going to go ahead and pull it out of here and see what we got. But that's basically what it looks like. Just some personal information. at and that's all it is. Bunch of baloney you don't need all that mess. I guess I could use this to return the phone, but I tried to do that one time with my dad to return my uh, 13 Pro Max. No, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. My bad. The 12, the, um, God, the 11 Pro Max right here. And apparently he got confused. I'm sorry. There we go again. Showing information. Apparently he got confused um, and thought that AT&T, because he can't hear all that well. I thought that AT&T told him that they was going to ship him out an empty box to return the phone back in so I can get a discount on the monthly payments under the two-year contract. Well, apparently he misunderstood because they're waiting for me to put it in the box that the phone actually came in, a box like this, to ship it back to them in order to get the discount. Well, I've changed my mind about the discount because unless they have that, that's not going to happen. And the phone's already paid off. So I'm going to try to sell it on Craigslist. Everything that comes with it for like about 150. See what I can get. Anyway, so I don't know. I might keep this box for that, but I have to find a way to scratch out all the information. I don't want nobody to see my information or try to peel that off. But that's something that I'll try to work on at a later time. Anyway, so here's the case, and we're going to take the case out and see what we got. So it looks like it just slides out right here. And trying to do all this with one hand. I'm not, I don't even have my tripod right now. You have to forgive me. This is not my regular filming time. I would ask that you guys be patient, okay? I know this video is not that professional, but as I said before, this is not my regular filming time. So I'm trying to do this with one hand. So, so I can just get this out. That'd be great. Pretty much got the phone out. That's all that matters. So here it is. It's kind of like a rubbery type case, like one of these where you can bend it and do all that. It's flexible, if you will. It's very simple, very standard. Just a very simple, plain replacement. I thought it was the hardback one, but apparently not, because it's flexible. I guess that helps with like if the phone was a fall or whatever. And already got fingerprints. Fingerprints. See, it's got fingerprints already, so whatever. Just a cheap case. Well, there you go. There's that. So I'm going to throw this away now. No screen protectors and all that stuff. Come with it. I'm going to put this on my phone now. All right, anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you didn't, I'll try to do better next time. I'm out the fan man and out.